what is driving the, the surge of people to the border. I know that there's a lot of conversation about, well, it's President Biden hasn't sent the tough signal that former President Trump did, but what's driving it? And, and how do you see it? Where do you see it going? Yeah. The most important thing I can say is that the, the tough signals that we do or don't send at the border is not what's driving it. If, if the four, last four years have taught us anything, it's that we can be as tough as we can imagine. I mean, the last administration took people's children away from them in the hope that that would deter people from coming and it didn't deter people from coming. So that tells you that the decisions we make around the border are not affecting what's driving migration. Uh, what's affecting migration is, is what's happening in the Northern Triangle countries um, to a degree. And I worked in the Obama administration where we, where we faced a, a, a substantial unexpected upsurge in migrants, especially unaccompanied children in 2014. Some of this is longstanding problems in the region. Some of it has to do with violence, gang violence, drug-related violence in the region. Some of it has to do with climate. Honduras had two hurricanes in the same region within the course of two weeks last year. Some of those communities are still underwater. Uh, and Guatemala is in an epic drought and has suffered failure of the coffee crop. So there is a, a, a climate uh, aspect to the migration that's happening. And the, the, the thing that is, I think, most important to understand is that this is, we have a refugee crisis in our hemisphere. That's what this is. And we will never fix a refugee crisis in our hemisphere with the measures that we take at the border. So the administration's job is to manage the border situation, following the law and hopefully following our values, while also taking steps to address the, the reasons that people are migrating in the first place, which is not a short-term fix, but which is essential if we're going to get our arms around this problem because we can't fix it at the border. 